But right now, I'm feeling a little bit hungry. Oh. I've been really paying attention to my macros. I've been working out a lot. And I have been drinking a lot of like meal replacement shakes because like we work a lot and we're going, going, going. So sometimes I just like need something quick. Otherwise, like I might not eat. Right. right? So, it, you know, it's not because I'm trying to not eat. It's because I am trying to eat that yep. I have this. But in order to make those, I use this blender that I just got. I love. This is cool. So here, much. Here it comes. This Ooh. is the Beast Blender. Whoa. The Beast. The Beast. And it is a very schmancy personal blender. As you can see, it's very sleek. It's very modern. Like it was very, very eye-catching. I'm sure it was advertised to me on social media and I'm very easily influenced. And I was like, oh, I need it. But it's actually, it is very, very, very good. So we've got a couple of pieces to this. So this is the actual blender base. And like, I really liked that it was a blender that I can keep out and it's like, ooh, what's that? Like it kind of looks like a fancy lamp. Right. Like it's, it's wild. Yeah. Uh, so, and then this comes off and then this is the blade. Ah, the blade. The blade of the beast. And so this, it came with two different size containers. So this is the larger one, and this is what I use every single day for my meal replacement shakes. Every day, I use that. And then it also comes with this smaller one, which is one that I, I made like a salad dressing in, Ooh, yeah. uh, which is really great. And it comes with lids. So there's these two containers. They come with two of these lids that look like this. So, you know, if you're someone who makes smoothies a lot, you could assemble it the night before, put this lid on it, and then in the morning you're like, floop, floop, flip it over, zoom, zoom, just shake your rump. Easy. <laughs> <laughs> and then it also comes with this hydration station. So you can buy it, hydration system. It comes hydration with this hydration system. system, but you can get just the blender if you want, or you can buy this separately too, I believe. But I was really surprised. I was like, sure, I'll get the add-on water bottle because this is not gonna, this doesn't work on the blender. Mm. Um, I love this water bottle. I use it a lot. I kind of, I switch between this one and my other water sippy cup that yep. I use. But it comes with this, which what you're supposed to do with this is in the blender, you blend up like pulp of something. So your cucumbers, your strawberries, your blueberries just enough not to blend it, blend it where it's gonna liquefy, just to like open it up so the juices come out. Then you fill this, and then when you put it in your water, it infuses the water. So this oh. is built to sit in here. Cool. And I did not know that that is what that uh, that part does. Yeah, it was like, wow, you're like, there's some part of this thing that she <laughs> just stays in the cabinet. <laughs> because I usually just drink water with lemon juice like it in a jar yeah just to keep it easy but you know it's a cool thing it is but a this, cool thing i like having this uh to drink water out of because it's glass and sometimes like i like to drink out of a glass but i am clumsy and i will spill it so i get to drink out of a glass but it has a lid <laughs> when i need to put the lid on it and that is just a sleek looking glass yeah uh water bottle yeah and when i i got it i thought i thought that it was going to be part of the blender stuff but it's not so just so you know the water bottle the hydration system is not to be used with the blender but i mean you could blend stuff and put it in there but this is i think more for water and it seems like a good deal to just get the hydration system mm -hmm. in addition to the the blender yeah and it's a really quality water bottle i have dropped this m multiple times already <laughs> Because uh, I take it with me to the gym and it's sturdy and it's got like a rubber bottom, so that's really protects it as well. I mean, I'm not throwing it on concrete, <laughs> but it's it's a little clutch proof. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, so let's me blend. Yeah, let's blend. So it comes with this, this lid goes on to this. So you can, you know, put your straw in here. It also so just similar, gives you... similar kind of lid to like the hydration system. Yes. Yeah. And then the, the top, top lid of the hydration station can go onto this so you can seal it, seal it if you need to take a smoothie on the go. Oh, which, that's great. You know, from time to time you need to do. That's it. So we're going to make myself a little 
meal replacement shake here. This is Huel. This is the black edition vanilla. And so I really like this. Like I've tried all sorts of protein shakes and meal replacement shakes. So I have a couple uh, that are different. So it depends on like where I'm at in my macro. So I'm really like focused on my protein right now. Cause you know, I work it out. That's right. <laughs> so beast I, mode, baby yes, beast mode. Yeah. So uh, one meal replacement shake that I use has like 240 calories and like 17 grams of protein. This one is 40 grams of protein and 400 calories. So like if I really want to load up on protein, say like I was not good about eating other proteins, I can have this and make sure I get like a good boost of protein. And I didn't think about this, but you said it, that Huel is human fuel. Human fuel. That's I right. I did not. I, I was like, Huel, whatever. Okay, cool. Yeah. yeah Either but, that or is invented by Huel Hauser. Yes. For all you California gold fans out there. But you I doubt. showed me California gold. That's right. Yeah. But probably more, more likely than not, human fuel. <laughs> human fuel. Yeah. 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 So the Beast Blender comes in a couple of different colors. I got the black one just because sometimes I'm like, I'll blend something with turmeric or, and then like that just stains everything. Yeah. So that's why I didn't get the white one or the pebble one, which is I think a little bit of a gray color. Hmm. The black one's really great. I feel like I can do blueberries, I can do beets, whatever, and it's not going to discolor the the blender. It's a smart, smart idea. Yeah. Smart gal. Uh, will you get me a little ice, please? Oh yeah, absolutely. So to make this shake super, super easy, and on this jar there's like a max number, a little line right there, so you know not to fill it beyond that. So I just take some ice. And not too much ice because it'll stall. So I just put like, oh, like five, five, six pieces of ice. And then. All done there? Yeah, that's it for that. Bye, ice. Thanks. Thanks for joining. Then ice. Ah. <laughs> and then uh, I'll fill this with water and I'll get close to the max line, but I don't really need it to be that full. And then I'll put in the Huel. So you can do one scoop or two scoops with the Huel. And one time I got this, it came with a scoop. And one time I got it and it didn't come with the scoop because this company is about sustainability and reusing things. So just when you look into it, just make sure you double check if you need the scoop, if you don't need the scoop. Because I didn't have the scoop. I was using a scoop for a different protein powder. And then when I did get the Huel scoop, I was not measuring it correctly. <laughs> and I'm trying to count my numbers. That's right. And it didn't work. So, so we're going to do But two now you've scoops. got the scoop. Now I got the correct scoop. Excellent. And, and you can weigh it also. So if you don't have the right scoop, you can weigh it and see mm -hmm. how much you need. So I'm going to do two scoopies. Scoop. Scoop. And another scoop. And I'm going to seal it up. So it's a resealable bag. Um, I tend to still put a clippy on it because it's not like really tight as far as like connecting it. Yeah. Uh, but it does help. It does help. Yeah. So then now I've got this going. We're going to just close it. And you want to make sure you close it good. And then we're going to blend it. All right. Yes. So on the back, we've got a... Whoa. No, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Too soon. Yeah. There's a power button on the back. And if it's on, you'll see a light. So now it's on. Again. Again. And you can pulse it just by pressing. Right? But if you hold it down for like a little bit longer than a second, it's going to go through a one minute cycle of blending. Let's do it. Cool. Yeah. Should we have a dance party? <laughs> One more round. Almost, One more almost. Round. All right. Yeah. It's cool. Like that. Yay! We we're did done. It. Woo! That was great. So it does that cycle, and you saw that it pauses for a second, and it like that I think is a really great feature because it lets the stuff settle, so then it can grab it again. Oh. Yeah. And crush it. 
Now, when you take this off, be careful because you can't untwist this without this, and then you're going to have smoothie all over Fuel the place. everywhere. So make sure you turn at the base where the blades are so you can flip it over. And then look at this. We got ourselves a nice, smooth little smoothie. Yeah. Yeah, and that's it's a good consistency. It's not like mm -hmm. super watery, but not super thick, which is how I like it. And then I put this on top. I take my straw and then, and then I got it. <laughs> Yummy. Do you want to try? Yes, please. So tell me what you think the Huel tastes like. Um, I mean, it tastes like a vanilla birthday cake. That's what I think too. Yeah. It tastes like cake batter. Mm -hmm. That I've tried so many replacement uh, meal replacement shakes and different protein shakes. This one and one other one is my favorite, but this one's the most like impactful. Yeah. But it does it taste like cake batter? You guys want to try? <laughs> Yummy. Tell me what you think. Yeah. That's great. <laughs> fantastic. Fantastic. Oh, and then with the beast blender, there is this is a separate instrument this doesn't come with it but you can buy it separately we didn't have it in the carousel but i just remembered it it's a little scooper scraper that fits exactly the inside of this so if you've got a really thick shake like i made a green smoothie in here and it was thick <laughs> and this is like Oof. nice because you can scrape it and just get all the good things. get all the goods out yeah, yeah you don't want to waste any of that good stuff mm -mm. all that work in. That's right. So this is a really cool tool that is designed specifically for the Beast Blender. So I like it. It makes my life easy because it's easy to grab. It's nice to look at. I love that the container is also the, the, the drinking vessel. Right. I don't have to transfer to a cup. I don't have to clean two things. I just clean this one. It's just like in constant rotation, like right. twice a day. Yeah. It's and it's not like... You have to take out a full blender, right? And like blend everything in a big blender, pour it out. Then you got to rinse out the blender, mm -hmm. rinse out the cup. It's like, you know, it helps, uh, you know, just consolidate, save everything yes. a little bit easier. Less steps. Yeah. And then I'm more likely, it, it's helped me keep on track with my nutritional goals because it's so easy to get done. And I like, like, I like blending in it. <laughs> I like. I feel like I say it every day. I was like, man, I love this blender. She loves this blender. <laughs> this is true. I've I've heard it uh, every day. Yes. That's great. May I have another sip of that? Please. That is that is very tasty. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> You've had it before. Mm hmm But you know, not in a questionnaire situation. Yeah. Yeah. But. And the good consistency cake too. Cake for sure. And that's where I like with this one. I think I went with the the water. Requirements that it says on the bag and it was a little too thick for me. Yeah, so I water it down a little bit more yeah. That's why like the sizing for this like, it's just perfect. It's just perfect 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 <laughs> I love your enthusiasm for for blenders. It's yeah. fantastic <laughs> This is just one more time so we can utilize this it's a Little this camera. camera look look at that. Look at that. It's so good. Wow. It's a little window on the bottom, too Which is nice yeah, so when you're seeing, when you're blending it, you can see from the top. It's also That's swirling. Spinning. Spinning. Yes. And, and the fact that, like, it was a personal size blender, but it's very generous in size mm -hmm. is really, really great. Because, like, I can make something a little bit bigger. There's other personal blenders that are on the market that are cheaper, but I just didn't like the way that they look. This one, I, I, I saw this, and I was like, this was made for me. <laughs> They know. It looks like a souped up like camera lens. <laughs> right. It's like like a, a good big blend. Yeah. But it's it's a it's a blender. <laughs> they got you. They got your number. Yeah. And then check out the Huel. I I really like it. I get a lot of meals out of it. Not every day of the week, maybe like five or six days. Yeah. And and any time that I'm just like, oh I can't. <laughs> Just, I'll just drink that. And that's, it's been really great. Yep. And then, oh. Uh, strong, guys. So look strong. At Look at this. Look at those muscles. Yes. Yeah. 